Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Gold, everybody's favorite metal. We use it to make jewels, idols, statues, and even teeth. Hey, we even use gold to wrap our chocolates. What if I told you that there are a few similarities between the gold wrapped chocolates and artificial satellites orbiting the Earth? You might not believe it, right? Well, I didn't. Maybe this picture might persuade you. Yep, it's the Chandrayaan 2's lander. If you look closely, the entire lander is wrapped with gold foil. You might think, so that's where all the gold of our country is going. Well, no, I can't tell you where the gold is actually going, but I can tell you why this lander is wrapped in gold foil. All the gold wrapping around the satellites is actually a material called multi-layer insulation or MLI. It is normally made of multiple reflective films. The reflective films are made of polyester and extremely thin layers of aluminium. Gold is actually not used in making the MLI. The components of the MLI just give it a gold color. The thickness of these layers depends on where the satellite will be orbiting, what it will be protecting, and also how much sunlight it will be exposed to. The main purpose of the MLI is to protect the spacecraft and the internal components from the extreme temperatures of space. The part of the spacecraft which faces the sun can have temperatures as high as 150 degrees centigrade, and the part which is in the shadow is as cold as negative 20 degrees centigrade. Due to the lack of atmosphere in space, most of the heat transmission occurs by means of radiation. So by making the external surface of the satellite with a reflective material, the majority of the radiated heat can be reflected back into space. The other reason is conduction. As I just explained, the two halves of the satellite are at extremely opposite temperatures, but we can actually use the temperature difference for our own advantage. The metal in the MLI regulates the total satellite temperature by conducting the heat from the hot side to the cold side. This reduces the temperature on the hot side and increases the temperature on the cold side and brings the total temperature of the satellite to within an operational range. Though gold is not really used in covering satellites, it is actually used in making spacesuits. Gold is a very malleable material by nature. In fact, it is so malleable that one gram of it can be beaten into a sheet covering nearly a square meter. This extremely thin layer of gold is coated over the visors of the astronaut's helmet to filter out infrared and ultraviolet radiations and protect them. Well, that's it guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. I'll see you again in the next one. Until then, bye.